And thanks for helping me pick out a new computer, you guys. Oh, no problem, Quagmire. God, this place is always so crowded. What are you doing? You gonna get a new phone while we're here? Maybe, but I gotta see which one I wanna take in and out of my pocket every 30 seconds for the next six years. You know what? I think I'm gonna go with this one. Guy said it's the newest version. Just came out this week. Yeah, good call, Quagmire. You're gonna be like the first guy in the neighborhood to own a Model T. Hello? Oh, hey, Quagmire. What's up? Hey, Peter, I, I need some help with my computer. I can't find my photos. Okay, you know what? Click on your hard drive. Okay, now, now the arrow on the screen, that's me, right? Yeah, yeah, that's you. Okay, now, now, now just... Whoa, 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 there's a calculator on this thing? Well, that seems a little foolhardy, doesn't it, Peter? Look, do we have to do this now? I'm watching something. I know, I'm sorry. I I'm just nervous that somebody else is gonna get pictures of their cat on the internet first. Jeez, Quagmire, calm down. We'll figure it out. No, Peter, the whole thing's fried. I can't even... Ah! Oh, damn it! What the hell? Hey, you clicked accept. Hi, can I help you? Well, that depends. Do you know how to fix pieces of junk? I, I tried to buy a, a sweater online, and I, I think I got a virus. No, the porn's not the problem. I want to see Latinas, but I also want them to speak, speak English. English. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Wow, so you're into that kind of stuff, too? Uh-huh. So, yeah, I was the first woman to ride her bike cross-country with no seat. <laughs> Oh, Glenn, I'm so glad you asked me out. Whenever I talk about stuff like this, most people look at me like I'm some kind of disgusting perv. Whom? Morning. <sighs> Morning. Oh, my God! You roofied me? Are you mad? No. I'm in love. Take this wine glass. We can use it later. My God, I... I've never been so happy. I'm telling you guys, Sonia is the perfect woman. She's every bit as kinky and as insatiable as I am. Really? I thought you said she was just some computer geek. She is. Jeez, you changed your relationship status already? When you know, you know. All right, but just be careful, you know? You don't want to rush an important decision. No. Yes. No. Glenn, why did you bring me here? Well, I've always had this fantasy of having sex on the basketball court in front of my high school principal. I did? Well, this isn't as much fun as I thought it would be. I I'm sorry, Sonia. I don't think I can finish. You never could finish, Quagmire. Donahue, get in there! Oh, wow, I can't even imagine what twisted deviant act you've thought of this time. I want you to have sex with your father. Did you enjoy your stay at the Marriott? No, I did not. Hey, guys. Yeah, no, 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 not, okay. not allowed. Don't do it. What? There's nothing wrong with this. No, no way. Give me those. No, she's not. Everything's great with us. Are you guys still talking about Sonia? All right, I should probably get going. Sonia and I are supposed to go to a brown eyes wide shut party. I know you just got back from Vietnam and you love me, but I'm gonna go run a train with this group of Black Panthers I just met. Hi, Forrest. Now that I have the most contagious and incurable disease known to mankind, I'll finally have pity sex with you. Hey, sexy. Sonia, what are you doing here? Well, I got tired of waiting for you to get home, so I thought I'd come to you. No. This is one of your fantasies, right? Public humiliation? No, oh, please! Come on, you love it. Ow! That's my word! You been drinking tonight, sir? Uh, no, officer. I just had a glass of dinner with my wine. Oh, hey, Mr. and Mrs. Quagmire. Hi, Peter. I'm a little worried about Glenn. I haven't heard from him in days. Have you seen him? Hey, get that one. Get that one over there. No, not, not that one. I already got it. I can't put it back. Well, now, let's not jump to any conclusions. I'm sure if we just check his usual hangout, someone will have seen him. Wait a second, he hangs out at the clam with some fat loudmouth. 
Okay, you guys, where should we start looking for Glenn? Well, sometimes Quagmire likes to hang out under all the clutter in my garage, so... If you're in there, hang tight, buddy. We're coming. Right, and if we can't find him in here, he sometimes likes to hang out in between the blades of grass in my lawn. Aloha. Welcome to Ryan's Hawaiians. Hey, how you doing? Amazing. Everyone looks good in my shirt. How about you, Big Island? Uh, I don't know. Do you want to be an oldies DJ or a 1980s wrestling manager? Yes, both. Oh, my God, this is hopeless. We've been searching for hours. Glenn could be dead by now. I know, and if you guys are really hungry, I suppose I could eat. Come on, we can't give up. Excuse me, did he just say Sonia? Yeah, it was his dog's name. Oh, I thought he might have been talking about this super kinky woman who's always down here trying to lure men to her sex slave shit. Apparently that chick's a complete psycho. We gotta get over there. Come on, you guys, let's go. Oh, man, I hope we don't catch him doing something freaky. This is it, number 92. This is Sonia's storage unit. Glenn! Hurry, she'll be back soon. We got company? Hold it right there. Please. Do you think I'm afraid of you? Everybody just shut up! You idiots should have minded your own business. This is our business. You kidnapped our friend. Like I said, you're going to jail. Oh, Glenn, I was so worried about you. Are you all right? No, no, I I'm pretty far from all right. Well, I guess this is as good a time as any. Thanks for your help, guys. I might not be alive if it weren't for you. Hey, no problem, buddy. Yeah, hey, you would have done the same for us, Quagmire. You know, I guess what I realized from... Yep, and it's good to put all those troubles behind us. My dad told me he's pregnant. We now return to Muppet Babies. Uh, Piggy, I don't think Kermie Jr. is doing so well. Kill me! I'm in constant pain! Bar, and he followed me home. You knew what you were staring at! Get out of here, you mess! You were far away! I didn't know what you were! You know you want me! Shut up! Now go home! Oh, you don't have to take your shoes off. Our house sucks. So, Quagmire, if you're some kind of big ladies' man, how come I never see you wearing a necklace? Ah, uh, uh, there's a bee in here. Uh, uh, uh. Wow, we sound amazing together. I know, that was incredible. You know, we should do something with this. Yeah, maybe we could open up a mattress store. So as you can see, the fiscal projections for the fourth quarter make this thing a slam dunk. Any questions? Not about my cow waters. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care, I'm not driving. Okay, what do you got for a lyric? I put a booger on a painting at the museum. I knew you were gonna be hot when you were nine. How about this? There you go, now we're jazzing. Don't store your condoms in your billfold. Broken rubber. Guys, I'm trying to do something up here that works better if I don't hear men singing. I'd like a sandwich, but I don't feel like eating two whole loaves of bread. Top. Cause I have thirty thousand dollars in credit card debt. When they call, I tell them I. What is that sound? It's like two Mandy Patinkins walked into my store. Was that you guys singing? Yeah. I'm, I'm actually up most nights with severe panic attacks. I've, I've taken to throwing up in the yard so my wife won't hear me. Oh yeah, and I should know. Back in the 1970s, I used to have my own record label, Mort Town. Oh, but I had to give it up. Do you remember? Olives, they were everywhere. It was so easy to get your hands on them. By 1975, the olives had control. What has happened to you, Mort Goldman? You've hit rock bottom. I'm lucky to be alive today. you do that for us? Sure I would. So what do you say? Can I be your manager? You betcha. All right, put it there. Well, I'm off to work. Bye, guys. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. I hate him so much, I'm shaking. All right, fellas, open mic at the library. Your first gig. Go get him. Hey, do I have time to get a drink at the water fountain where the water does not crest above the dispenser? Sure. Fellow card holders, please put your hands together for Griffin and Quagmire. It's as though I'm watched by strange, strange faces. faces. It's why. 
Just grab one and go. I'm looking for a job, okay? Bowl poop before my anus bleeds. Well, I guess no one cares about our music. I thought we were pretty good. Yeah, I've seen worse performances. Guys, I got great news! Oh, what is it, Mort? I put your performance on YouTube. The promoters of the New England Music Festival saw it. <laughs> oh, my God. We are so random.